Someone impacting another person's life in a negative way? Uh, I would say when uh, someone causes harm to another person. Any physical or verbal abuse? Bullying is when a group of people or one person are mentally or physically trying to hurt someone else. When someone is constantly victimized. It's just generally when someone makes someone else feel really bad or hurts them. It's someone mentally or physically degrading someone for one's own amusement. It's when someone uses their superior strength or influence to force somebody to do something they don't want or to hurt them, whether it's emotionally or physically. Harm or intimidate those of the weaker class. It's harassed, embarrassed, blackmailed, or pressured, um, hurt by others physically, mentally, or through the internet. I have seen someone get bullied in all three ways. Yeah, it's more so in high school than anywhere else. At a very small school, so I definitely saw my fair share. I definitely uh, witnessed bullying before in my life, and I feel like it's one of those inevitable things that really just happens to everyone at least once. Myself been pushed around. I've been to points where I was in a corner, couldn't do anything. Just be a guy like pushing another dude around, you know, that, that happens really all the time. I got called names because of how I looked. I was a smart kid. I was kind of a nerd. Would always discriminate this person and people would usually look down upon her. And she completely left me out and just decided she didn't want to be my friend anymore and she was mean to me. My close friends had a party and didn't invite me and then later that night um, they all decided to call me and at different times and text me and call me a slut and a whore and accuse me of sleeping with one of our other friends because they thought it was funny. Like sending a text message or a Facebook post or saying something to someone directly that was uh, mean or rude. When I was bullied, I felt terrible about myself. I felt like everyone was right and that maybe I was those things. But I just tried to push it off and ignore it. I felt bad about myself. I felt sad a lot. When I was being bullied by this certain group of people, um, it was probably one of the worst things that had happened to me. bully kind of made me stronger because I don't really listen to what people say and I don't really care anymore. Slowly I've started to feel better about myself and more confident but even though there are still those little bits, those little marks that bullying left on me. Now like whenever I come close with someone I'm always afraid that maybe someone else is gonna come between us. I don't usually trust people as much anymore, um, especially girls. I don't usually trust girls very often because um, the whole ringleader of the person that was bullying me was this girl that I trusted for a very long time. I knew some people who took their own lives to bullying. Uh, three to be exact, one shot himself, the other one hung himself, and a girl OD'd. Starting out there it just shows how important it is not to do it. And as you can see, loss of life is easily a factor in it. Cause I don't need boxes wrapped in strings and design a love and empty things just a chance to me.
Now what if you could prevent all of this? Anyone can be a bully. Teasing versus bullying. Well, teasing is fun until it gets to the point where someone is threatened, hurt, scared, and helpless. When I was bullied, I didn't tell any teachers or parents or anything like that because you get to a certain point, you get to a certain age, I guess, where you don't feel it's necessary to involve um, adults, which is a terrible feeling for kids to have these days. My way was not talking to anyone about it and just keeping it to myself. Sometimes going home and letting it all out by crying. So I talked to my dad about it and he just kind of talked me through it and told me that they weren't right and that I have to ignore those kind of people because that's, those are the type of people that I'm going to run into for the rest of my life. Our family has been deeply affected by bullying. It's one of the hardest things to watch as a parent. Our daughter is such a positive force of energy, it was very hard to see her spiral into a dark and negative place. Fortunately, we were there for her to give her unconditional love and support. We believe it just takes one positive role model to make a difference in a child's life who's struggling emotionally that there is hope, the bullying, you can get away from it, it won't, it won't destroy your life.